Welcome to IS with Santosh. My name is Santosh Pandey. I have cracked the UPSC prelims examination all six times. And in this video, I am going to share some of my tricks which has helped me to score one of the highest marks in the UPSC prelims examination. Guys, in UPSC, the manner they frame question. Okay, they want you to use common sense and some option elimination trick. In UPSC, if you think that if you know everything and then you have to solve the questions, Definitely, I can tell you, you cannot solve more than 50 questions. I am speaking from my experience that more than 30 to 40 questions in the UPSC prelims, I have solved using my option elimination trick, which I have learned through my experience of my six prelims attempts. And in this video, I am going to share another option elimination strategy, which you can apply in the examination. Guys, this I have observed not just in one year, but over a course of 10 years and then I am sharing this as a rule. Okay, I am sharing this as a rule, not like just once it has come and that's why I am sharing with you. No, it is a rule and if you apply 99.99% it will apply. So let us see this question guys. There is a PIQ question. What are the consequences of a country becoming the member of Nuclear Suppliers Group? Okay, NSG. What are the consequences? What will happen if a country gets into NSG. Okay, if you read the first statement, the first statement says that it will have access to the latest and most efficient nuclear technology. Okay, this probably is correct. Why? Because once you become a member of an elite group, which is the NSG group, obviously you will have access to, okay, you will have access to latest and most efficient technologies. Let us read the second statement. The second statement says that it automatically becomes the member of treaty of non-proliferation of nuclear weapon it automatically becomes so this can be a troublesome statement for many of the UPSC aspirants this can be a troublesome statement for many of the UPSC aspirants so if you carefully read the statement if you carefully read the statement it uses an word automatically automatically guys this is an extreme statement. This is an extreme statement. Whenever UPSC in the prelims examination uses any extreme statements automatically. Okay, some country automatically, suddenly, okay, drastically. Such kind of statements, whenever you will see in the UPSC prelims examination, I can challenge you 99.99% those statements are incorrect. Okay, you can eliminate this. You can eliminate this, you can eliminate this, the answer will be one only. The answer will be one only. So what rule did we learn today? We have learned one rule which says that whenever there is a use of an extreme word, okay, automatically this will happen. Okay, if you if you do this automatically, this will happen. 99% of the cases, those statements will be incorrect. Okay. So guys, it is very important that you observe such things when you solve the PYQ. Okay. Many students what they do is that they solve the PYQ mechanically. Don't do that mechanically because what will happen that I can frame some other question. Let me just show you. Okay. I can frame some other question. Okay. I can in place of nuclear supplier group. Okay. In place of nuclear supplier group, I can frame some other group. Okay. Like for example, suppose I write quad. Okay. If a country becomes a member of quad, then this will automatically happen. Okay. Such kind of statements in future they can frame. Okay, if you become a member of this, okay, for example, if suppose India is trying to become a member of UNSC, UNSC, so they will give some statement, okay, that if you become a member of UNSC, permanent member of UNSC, automatically this will happen, automatically that will happen. Okay, these kind of traps they can lay, and you will think that okay, I don't have I don't know this, so I cannot solve this, guys. You can still solve without knowing that you can still solve if you know all the golden rules of option elimination. And guys, I'm telling you through this YouTube channel, through this YouTube channel, in the next 30, 40 days, I will make you a master of option elimination technique. And you can also attend my mega webinar on option elimination technique, which I am going to hold on 29th of April. Okay, somewhere end of this month okay you can register using the phone number which is given in this video okay you can register yourself for that 
there is going to be a very three hours okay very comprehensive at one place i am going to share all these tricks in three hours and we are not going to just okay solve those tricks we are going to solve questions also in that mega webinar so don't miss that mega webinar guys if you are getting benefited by these videos and if you want me to continue making such videos do support this initiative okay it is a completely free initiative that webinar will be mostly okay it will be also completely free please contact that phone number okay and please do okay please do like and comment and share with your other upsc friends thank you friends bye bye take care